Salam and welcome back to another very exciting video. Today I decided to make a super badass poster of the great, the legend Habib Nurmagomedov. By the way, fun fact, what I just said is not how you pronounce his name. Um, the actual way of pronouncing his name is Habib Nurmagomedov. And if you don't believe me, well... Habib Abdumanapovich Nurmagomedov. Oh. This is my, like, correctly. Well, you're freestyling. You're making stuff up now, but it's okay. DC, this is your friend. Get his name right. Come on. <laughs> All right, so let's begin. So I started off uh, by bringing this image into Photoshop. Then I brought um, this eagle image and um, started to cut out using the pen tool and then I placed him on um, his shoulder um, just to see if um, it matches you know it's very important and then I use the puppet tool to do some alignment and I manually drew some feathers just like that by the way if you haven't already make sure to subscribe then I sort of uh, made a selection of these legs of the birds uh, which are going to be on top of uh, his shoulder and the rest is going to be behind. And then I made a selection of um, Habib and I made a background gradient adjustment layer um, to sort of give it a um, custom background. And then I made a text layer and um, wrote his name. I initially was um, going to try to match with UFC font but um, as you can see it looks garbage so I changed that. Then I started um, to make some color corrections to this eagle and then I thought it would be a cool idea um, to put some texture um, on the text for some reason I don't know but as you can see it doesn't look that good so I'm trying to fix that. And now it's time for some shadows. Um, let's go ahead and make this more realistic. I made everything very dark and um, inverted the mask and started painting some shadows. And then I went on to give it some more shadows, some sharp ones and some light, you know, soft ones. And then I played with, um, and then I played with the curves adjustment layer um, just to make him bit more darker because the light is coming from the back side so he should be darker so and then I started um, to put some highlights you know because why not and uh, because the lighting was very difficult um, on the original picture um, it's coming from the left side and the front right side it was a bit of a tough one to um, compensate for that and then I made the background even more darker um, because, you know, it should be if um, the light is only coming from the back side. Some more highlights. And now let's go ahead and make this um, text a bit more glowier. To do that, I made a solid adjustment layer and um, gave it a green color and made a mask, an inverted mask and painted the mask with white color. And then for good reason, I abandoned the idea of um, giving the text a texture and uh, made the whole thing white. So it looks much better now. At this point, I was thinking there's still something missing. So I thought, why not make the UFC logo glowier? Um, I keep saying glowier. I don't even know if it is the real word. I copied the exact same light source from the back of um, his head, uh, the text on the back. And um, yeah, I, use, I use the same thing to color to make the light of the UFC. Okay, I will stop talking. And then I thought, uh, why not give some highlights to these abs as well? Because, you know, why not? And it looks even more badass. And then I did some refinement to the highlights. And then I thought, um, why not make this eagle a bit darker as well? And then I thought, let's uh, put some smoke. That's going to look really, really good. And then I brought some um, fire particles um, and it does look good, thankfully. And then I made them green because the theme is kind of um, have become green. I don't know why. And then I spent an infinite number of time um, to decide where um, this 
undefeated text would go because I couldn't decide where it would go. Two thousand years later. And then I just put it um, right where I started it off in the beginning. All right, now it's almost done. Now it's time for um, some final touches and some camera or filter. And then I was thinking, where should I put my logo? So I thought, why not do this? Let me know in the comments if this was a stupid idea. All right, guys, um, that's about it. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think about this in the comments and uh, let me know what I should be making next. And if you guys like this video, don't forget to put a like and um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, salam. The more I learn to live, wish that I can be somebody that can live just like you did. And now that I know my life's been such a bliss.